Hey guys, DMike here for another episode of Super Nintendo Sundays. You might be asking yourself, holy moly, we finished World 2? Well, not exactly. Because like I told you last time, I played one of these games. I deleted my save file, so I just went ahead and 100%ed all these levels in advance. Of course, right? That's what happened. So let's go ahead and do a couple of... Couple of, ooh, these these look very questionable. Looks like uh, maybe when you use some protection, perhaps. Whoa, what is going on here? Oh, okay, great, awesome. Starting off on the right foot. I don't know what I'm doing. Also, full disclosure, I I ended my last recording prior to everything becoming a disaster in my life with like a bunch of. Okay, so I don't know. How do we... How do we... Can I... What is happening? Can I spit these guys out and they give me... What? What on... What? What in the heck and heck do I have to do here? To get these gosh dang coins. Is there anything back? Okay. I do feel bad playing through these games sometimes. At least the Super Nintendo ones, because I'm... You know, this round I decided to play three games I'm not familiar with. And I have a bit, oh, am I getting, okay. I have a bit of a tendency to not really explore as much because I'm not super familiar with these games. Then again, I guess, you know, maybe it's actually fair because I'm playing them more like I would have when I was a kiddo. Cause I probably sucked at everything. So, you know, you get, you get a little taste of reality, maybe. Well, I'm giving up on trying to get that massive blob of coins. I don't really don't know what I'm doing. Pretty confused what's happening right now. As I'm being haunted by flying latex. What is going on? Not entirely sure what's happening, but I do need to kind of be careful. Because like I said, I don't really have a whole lot of lives right now. I believe I have two. Because of my current circumstances. I have no idea how I'm supposed to get this. I don't know. Uh, just like- oh boy. I guess I can just shoot another coin. I almost jumped down there. That would've been smart, right? Where's your self-preservation, D-Mike? Well, here at D-Mike Industries, we pride ourselves on exploring different levels of self-preservation. That's what it's all about, folks. You won't know if you're taking a risk until you take it, so... Hmm. That's an intelligent thing to say, right? Okay, so we're underground. This much I do know is that things are getting a little spoopy. Okay, really big fan of being told something that I learned, I don't know, roughly every episode ago? That's kind of weird. Ooh. Okay, I guess I have to go back and- oh, I didn't even know there was a little star hanging out. Let's go ahead and load up on these spooky critters. I don't really know what anything is called, but when I was playing this game around Halloween time, which is kind of weird to think about, but, you know, these series, when I play them, it's once every three weeks, and... We started this. That was cool. You're welcome. We started playing all three of these. I don't remember the exact date, but you know, it's been it's been a minute. It's been a minute, so. Okay, so I'm actually doing like super epic at clearing all these blocks out. So that's pretty cool. Oh boy. Gotta deal with these Zubat real quick. Oh boy. Okay. This is actually really nice. It's replenishing my uh my eggs. My eggs. Eggs? Very nice. Enjoy that. Maybe this level is just a little little breather for me because of the game sensing my my duress. The level of frustration and stress I've had lately with all these shenaniganigans. Ooh. I'd like to get all these. Okay. I semi apologize in advance if you can Maybe in the background here, the absurd weather conditions that I'm dealing with. Okay. Um, this is cool. I don't remember how to do anything. Okay, that was nice, I think. Anyway, not, that's not nice. But I apologize in advance if you can hear a little bit of the weather conditions in my current area. It is, uh... Quite precipitatory. I don't know if that's a word. It is now. 
but uh, it's a little bit of freezing rain. Ah, sleet, sleet. So you can fill in the blanks with the rest of that classic children's song. Okay, so we're just gonna keep moving along. I don't know if I'm going anywhere remotely close to where I'm supposed to be going, but I figure a little exploring is kind of warranted given the circumstances. Haven't really been doing as much of that, so I'm gonna make it up to you guys. Just stop bullying me. Anyway, so I don't know why on earth the game now is like just starting to ramp up like these little tutorials. I don't, I'm just not entirely sure what is being gained from this because, you know, we've come pretty far. This is World 2, Level 3? Yeah. Am I supposed to have filled these in? Morph into the mole tank? How? Is there a way to do that? Ooh. Where do I dig into the wall, though? It's like... I like that the game doesn't really like ask, like, hey, do you want to dig into the wall? It's like, dig into the wall now. Or we will kill your family and poop on your grave. Jeez, game, take it easy. We do get the key, though. The key! That's one of the things I haven't been doing lately, is collecting anything. I'm kind of bad at that. Sorry. Maybe. I apologize a lot. Maybe that makes me feel better. Does it make you feel better? You get apologized? It's a good question. How does apologies... How does apologies... How do apologies feel, everybody? Do we like being apologized to? Does that feel good? Someone gives you the old... Oops! Sorry! They gotta mean it, though. That's... That's part of the... Of the dynamic. If they don't mean it, then heck on them. Okay, so I have this key. I don't know where I'm gonna stick it. Hopefully there is a, uh... Ooh, I can shoot up, nice. Is it up there maybe? Is there a place to shoot, to stick my big key up here? Ooh, wait, 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 no. Oh, gosh dang it. Well, I did see that there's a flower up here. Maybe I can just shoot it? Is the game not gonna let me now? Cause it's like, nope, you screwed up. You big, you big dummy. You don't get more chances, because we hate you. Man, come on, I know you're up there. Get out of here. Oh, there he is. There we go. Okay. Did I get, oh, I wasn't even close. Or maybe it was close, I don't know, whatever. There's gotta be. This is a weird level, I don't know. Like, am I doing anything right? I'm kinda confused right now. I'm assuming this Bow Wow boulder wants to get pushed. One step closer to the... Okay. So, is there anything... Okay, that's death, everybody. Great. Should we restart from the middle ring? Yes. The middle ring of just sheer embarrassment. I don't know how much progress I just wasted doing this. Great! Classic eight minutes into an episode and then I just blow it like this. Don't you love that? Isn't that quality? Doing great! I wish the game would be kind of like the... Oh, get, get at it. Oh. That actually let me walk for a little bit. That was kind of weird. Then maybe there's a little platform down there. So much for not having self-preservation with the amount of lives I don't have. All right. We gotta buckle down here. We're getting close to continue land with this game over here. Okay. This is wild. You know what else is wild? It is, uh, just about that time of year, kind of in a rare circumstance here in 20 Dos Dos, where uh, we're having an Olympics. That's exciting. Yeah, Olympics. Not sure if people enjoy the old international competitions. I think it's kind of neat. There's a lot of circumstances that make the Olympics a little bit hard to enjoy. Now, as you get older, it's not just about the sports anymore. There's a lot of there's a lot of shenaniganery going around behind the behind the scenes. You know, usually involving money, unfortunately. 
It's definitely an international affair, but it's not just about the sports anymore, which is unfortunate. And uh, one of the things I really enjoy about the Olympics, well, at least about the Winter Olympics, is I'm a big fan of hockey. It's one of my favorite sports. I think it's great. Some people might be convinced that I'm a Canadian brother from another mother. But, uh, yeah. Unfortunately, this year, they are having... I mean, I say that like they're not having hockey. They are, which is great. But it's not going to be at the highest level, unfortunately. They decided to have an exclusion with that, which is a little bit of a bummer. It's cool that they're going to have it. And the people that are participating anyway, they deserve to have their shot. And maybe they wouldn't have otherwise. You know, this is... There's always a... There's always a silver lining. There's always a golden shower. So, I mean, just think of it from that perspective. There's always the chance that somebody who historically wouldn't get the chance. Now they do. So that's kind of neat. And, uh, you know, happy for them. Hopefully all the... They just, I just hope people have fun. Just have, have a good time. Enjoy yourself. Because I know I will. But one of the things that I am also enjoying and looking for, well, I'm not enjoying yet because I haven't seen it. But one of the things that I am going to look forward to is that this year, unlike other years, there's a sport called curling, which I don't know if any of you are familiar with that, but it's on the long sheet of ice and you throw a stone and you try to get it into the, into the bullseye. And the team that gets it closest into the bullseye after a handful of tries between each of the teams gets points. Yeah. I did, uh, I did a little excursion with some friends, played some curling, that was fun, got to experience that a little bit. It's definitely different, it's definitely something that I would say everyone should try if you're into the winter sports, and one of the things that I think I like most about curling is that it's a sport that when you watch it, you might be falsely impressioned that it's kind of a like a goofy kind of silly not difficult sport you'd be wrong it is definitely tough i remember the day after i got done doing it and this might just be because i'm wildly or i was wildly out of shape at the time i remember ooh, i remember my body just being a, not a wonderland my body was very upset with me so this is a nice little stone to put oh that's it well, where's the where's the hacking door? I'm gonna go look back and see if I can find it. I might actually have gone so far that I can't get back and get it. I don't know. I'm wasting a lot of time. This episode's gonna be long. Not like the last one wasn't. I mean, goodness. Did you guys enjoy watching 35 minutes of me just completely forgetting how to play Do Re Mi? How about that? That was exciting. But anyway, curling. Curling. I mean, this is all about my misadventures. So technically, you know, it's all in line. It all makes sense contextually. But anyway, yeah, I have no idea where it is. Anyway, doors be darned. So curling is one of the, how do I get down there? I just want to get down there so bad. I don't know. Curling though, it takes a lot of balance. It takes a lot of core strength. You got to lock in that core, keep that core nice and tight. And you can't, you can't fall or you'll bust your noodle. We got four of the five stars. That's good enough. I've already spent nearly 14 minutes on this level. And you get a bonus there anyway. Good enough. You know what? No mini game, but this is kind of like a mini game, so I don't want to hear it. I'm just trying to put dinner on this table and provide for this family, okay? So there you go. 100%, 100, 100 points. Well done, me. We've got a uh, lemon, lemon pea colored Yoshi. So we're going to flip some item cards. I don't think I've seen this one yet, so this is cool. Great. Is that it? Okay, so we immediately failed. So, wonderful. What else is new? Okay, here we go. No surprises here. This looks kind of spoopy. We get to fight a... Bigger Booze Fort. I love a nice pair of big booze. So, the... Oh, but we can't swallow booze, but we can stomp on this switch. This looks like this is time, so we will hurry. I only have the one life, so I have but one life to live. Also, the boo in these games? Holy smokes, that's adorable. Look at this. But yeah, so curling, you have to kind of find a way to really balance yourself 
balance yourself. And in doing so, you'll find that like eventually over time you'll get better at it. But one of the toughest parts for me at least, great, I made stairs. I am a carpenter, like Jesus. So over time, you'll definitely get better at balancing yourself. I mean, I shouldn't say that. Like maybe you will never get better and you'll just be an abject failure of balance. But if you are not horrible like me, you'll get better. One of the toughest things I noticed when I was playing is how much energy it just takes to get yourself going as you play. It's kind of brutal, but it's fun. And uh, I remember it was me and some friends against this family with a couple of, uh, it was like a mom and dad and their two young daughters. Absolutely destroyed them. Like no, no competition. They had no shot. It was amazing. So, you know, no participation trophies here. Especially with people who can't say the word participation. No big thing. So, give it a try. Prepare yourself for the eventual soreness. That's one of the things you got to be careful of. Is is uh is just how sore you'll be the next day. Okay. So I think with these boos, maybe the how do I kill him? My butts? No. Not butt stomp the boo. I want to take it out though. I feel like you get a prize. So maybe you gotta shoot it while it's coming at you? Oh, come on. I'm running out of eggs. I'm running out of eggs? I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. I just wanna... Oh my gosh. Well, there's that. Another failure of a minigame? Surprise! But anyway. It's fun, and one of the things that I think is interesting, if you're not into this, that's okay, is uh, curling encourages having, there's a lot of camaraderie and having adult beverages. So I think that's really interesting. Now, am I not able to, to progress because I don't have eggs? I know there's the ones up there, but I guess I can get, if I go in here, can I get the ones that are on the floor? Yes. So I will not fight these boos because I don't care. I mean, you know, speaking of boos, there's actually at the club that I went to, maybe this is not standard and maybe I'm just at a curling club with a bunch of alcoholics. The rinks that I was at had specific coasters and like little holders for you to put your drink, which I think is hilarious. So now can we push this? Can we push it? Yes, we can push it. How do I... I think... I think... I already learned that I can't... Okay. This is excellent. I'm doing wonderfully right now. I have no idea where anything is. I don't know how to get down. I don't know how to get up. Get down, get up. Don't know how to do anything right now. So... Bear with me. That's a cool looking enemy. Not sure what's happening. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay. What is this? Ooh. Probably should have used an egg there instead of wasting that. I feel like I just want to make progress and just get out of here at this point. I'm a little weirded out by all these goofs. Was that a one? Okay. So you have to go all the way around. You got to bring it around town again. I got plenty of eggs though. Plenty of eggs. So I'm doing fine on that front time front I'm not doing quite as well on because of how much energy I've wasted trying to do dumb stuff. But what else is new? Okay, so there we go. I can't get up to this. So I guess you just gotta kinda... Where's it? Ooh, the key! There we go. There we go. Guys, I figured it out. The game kinda handed it to me a little bit. They're like, here, dummy. That's okay. Where's that key door? I don't remember. Up over yonder? Okay, now, okay, look. This has totally been planned the entire way. Completely scripted. I don't know. Okay, here we go. Hopefully this is getting me closer to the ye old exit, because this level is a ye old pain in my buns. That was not a very good shot. How about that? Yeah, you like that? You like it when I shoot your coins with my eggs? Here we go. Oh, was I... Was I supposed to get something from this? Like, is there something in this? Oh, just stars. Okay, so that was just a bit of a detour. 
what we like to call in the business uh, pointless. So here at DMike Industries, we will give every location a thorough looking at. That's not true. We'll try. I'm trying. Okay, so I think in order to use this, I have to just go. Oh, crap. Come on. That's not going to do it. I think it wants me to go all the way up and around. I don't know how you have enough time to do that. I don't foresee that being a thing that I have time for. I got to rebuild the stairs here. I don't know if there's enough time to actively do that. I feel like maybe I have... If I can hit that switch with an egg, then I'll be okay. But not... Otherwise, no. Okay, so... Um, yeah, because you get stuck here. There's a switch that's down there. So maybe if I hurry... Okay, so... I guess not? But there is that switch... That, okay. I'm thoroughly confused right now what I'm supposed to be doing. I don't know if I... Hmm. This is quite the conundrum. I know that I need that. But I don't think I can shoot eggs and hit a switch. No, it does not appear. But these enemies are giving me a headache here. Oh! <laughs> Well, that's just great, isn't it? Well, we've never seen what happens when this occurs, so... There you go, everybody. You're welcome. That's a fun sound. Well, I guess we will. Okay. Wow. That was quite the, uh... Quite the quality performance, if I do say so myself. How about that? At least I know where I don't need to go anymore, so that's nice. Yeah, the Olympics are cool. Curling is cool. Another thing that begins to see that's cool is chili. That's probably what I'm going to have for dinner. Not talking about the feeling of being cold. Just about the food. How do we feel about chili, everybody? Do we like chili? Maybe a nice red chili. With a tomato sauce. Some ground beef or turkey if you're feeling like you're uh, too good for flavor. Some beans? Do we like beans? Beans? I like beans. I like beans in my chili. I don't know. I can't butt stomp through the stairs. I'm wondering if it's a situation where I have to go through this door and then get the key, the key, and then come back around. I think that's what it is. I think I figured out the puzzle for children. Here we go. All right. So first things first, I need to use one of my eggs. Hit this. Now we're putting it all together. We're using our noggin. Here at DMike Industries, we pride ourselves on using our noggin. The key. Then we can head back. Avoid the Shy Guy Ghosts, which are uh, adorable. Uh, uh, adorable. Uh, 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 adorable. So we will go. And hit up the room, the door with the big old hole. We're going to stick our big old honking key in it. We're figuring it out, guys. We're doing it. We're doing it live. Here we go. So then we have to go up here. We got to go up here. Okay. Maybe I can just do this. Excellent. Now we're just a speedrunner because we're almost 25 minutes in and we've made no progress. Great. So we'll push this aside, and we'll ignore it. We're gonna ignore it. We don't care about those stupid stars anymore. Think of those stars and their family. Okay. So, <laughs> there it is. Look at that. Ignore the steps the second time around. It's like a little bit of a, uh, a bit of a poozle. Then you hit this one. Yeah. Yes, I did it. I'm the master of this game, said no one ever. Okay, so now look, oh, this is a little kind of weird on the, I'm not 100% sure on the perspective here, it's kind of, oh god, this is going to be horrible, isn't it? I imagine this is going to be horrible, okay, what else am I supposed to, oh, do I try this? 
I feel like this is not meant to be... Okay. This is not going to remain this easy for some reason. I just have a feeling that something horrible is going to happen. Maybe not. Okay. This is quite, quite a long and industrious fort here. Fort with these big old boos. Okay, I'm just gonna try to collect all these eggs as I can and move forward. Just kinda wanna be done with it. We're looking for those big red doors. That signifies that we've made it to, uh... I don't know... Okay. I have no idea... Okay, so we can jump on those. Oh boy. This is terrifying. I don't... Like, I get it, but I also really don't like this because the... The geometry of that... Geometry? Was a little strange. Here we go. Alright, can we just get this over with, please? I've had enough. My life has been difficult enough playing games on the internet. So they have Luigi. They're just taunting us. They're not gonna hand him over. Surprise! That's so weird. I didn't do a good job fighting Boo the first time. Just in that little room, so I have no idea if what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, they give you little, uh, little bats. So I wonder if you just gotta... You just gotta throw... This is really annoying. If you just gotta throw eggs at him from uh, when he's not looking at you. That looks like... Oh, I, that worked, actually. I kind of whipped it off the wall a little bit. I guess that works. Oop, we gotta keep jumping over him though, he's getting... He's got some girth. Okay. Yeah, if you just ricochet off the wall, it seems like that's a pretty effective thing to do, but you gotta really be careful here because of how big he is. Okay, so things are getting a little a little testy here. Oh boy. Yeah, he's uh, huge. I think that does it. I don't know how many shots that was, but... Also, Yoshi's face there is great. Whew. Okay. We have dispatched the ghost. We are the ghost buster. All right, let's see how close we got. Another 100%. Nice. Well done. There it is. So that was two levels in this episode. Levels three and four. We'll take on five and six next time. I've been D-Mike. This has been Super Nintendo Sundays of Yoshi's Island, and I'll see you next time. Bye.